Hey YouTube, what's up? I'm coming at you with a little problem that I got here with the black truck. It's uh, basically going to be troubleshooting a speedometer issue that I've been having. I've been uh, had my speedometer all of a sudden start working. So what happened was, now imagine this in the dash. Basically what happened was I was driving along, it was kind of ticking, it was ticking, it was ticking, and then all of a sudden it made one big jump and then bottomed out. Fell, didn't start running until I pulled it out. Now, that could be a couple of problems. What ended up happening, that I think I've found, sorry about that, had to get out of the wind, um, I knew it had to be one of three things. It either had to be the cable itself, the speedometer here, or this little unit right here. This connects the cable from, here's a spare speedometer cable that I have laying right here. Basically, this fits on to the end of that, and this is what drives this. So this will go into here, and it's what, sorry guys, I'm trying to do this with one hand, but you'll see it turns this little um, <clears throat> mechanism in here, and that's what affects the actual speedometer. So if I turn it, and I turn it, because it has to be at a consistent speed, I can't just turn it once and it goes up there. If I start turning it, it makes the needle jump. So, what I ended up doing was, first things first, I came down here, uh, Alright, this here is the bottom of the speedometer cable that comes in to the actual housing in there. And if you look, right here is where it attaches. You want to get it to actually attach into here. What you do is you make sure that goes in there and screw it down tight. Well, what I did was, I came down, I pulled it out, and then I took my drill, which I happen to leave right there. Oh, sorry about the poor video quality guys, this is really impromptu. I did not plan on making one of these videos right now. But what I did was, I took the end of the uh, speedometer cable, the actual inner cable, I attached it to the drill, and I started turning my drill. What that does is it makes this spin, which it's really messed up and I think it's creating the majority of my problems right now. That spins it, which spins the cable on the inside, which makes the speedometer actually work. Now, let me get back out from under here. Uh. Oh, that was my head hitting a door. <laughs> And so, what I ended up doing was pulling this out. Let's check in there. I noticed two things. One, this little piece here was sitting right there whenever I got it taken out. And two, that it was not turning. So I ended up having to pull this out, put this on there, and I'm going to get back to you from there and see what I can do to fix it. Well, I ended up figuring out what was wrong here. Um, see right there? It's a pretty big deal. This is my old speedometer cable. I just pulled it out and uh, ended up finding that this, which had been originally uh, secured to my frame through some zip ties, just kind of get it up there, get it away from anything that could get hot, <clears throat> fell out and it uh, ended up landing on the exhaust. So you can see there it just melted all through and tore all, all kinds of crap out of this wire. Got to the point where it uh, the cable on the inside, which is the part that needs to turn, no longer turns. So it's locked up, it's all messed up, and uh, now all I gotta do is get a, a new speedometer cable, plug it in there, and it should work out just fine. So yeah. Now I got it uh, attached up in there, should be all ready to go, and now let's uh, put her in drive and let's see if it starts to register. Here 
we go. We now have a working speedometer, everybody. Let me uh, get myself to an intersection up here so I can sign off carefully and uh, be able to get to a stop. But yeah, now I got the whole working speedometer. It all works in, checks out, doesn't even tick anymore. So it should be perfect. All right, so um, that's pretty much it for this video. So uh, like, subscribe, do what you gotta do. I'll see y'all in the next one.